What's up, people? How's it going? It's me, it's me, the one and only REG, putting the MIC. And welcome to another episode of Talk Wednesday. Hope everybody's doing fine. Hope everybody's doing well. Man, we had some storms this past weekend. Wow. Um, I think there was like 13 deaths due to the storm. We had some crazy, crazy thunderstorms roll through. Tornadoes. Oh, man. And you know, um, one of my biggest fears is being in a tornado at night yeah uh, that's one of my biggest fears because you can't see anything uh, you know you really can't see the the, the, the um, funnel cloud or, or anything at night and that's it's really that's one of been that's been one of my biggest fears but um anyway as you know I went to the doctor um, December 19th and me and my wife were talking about this the other day and she goes um, you know I'm proud of you I said why is that because uh, you're you are at least trying to change your diet to become healthy you know um, and the reason why she said that is because she has a co-worker who um, who it's like not even trying you know She's just still eating the same stuff, still, you know, eating the sweets and everything. Yeah, I've cut down drastically, and I have to to stop and think, man. I'm I'm sort of a different beast, you know. Um, some people can quit cold turkey, and I'm one of those persons who who will quit cold turkey. I I have to. You know, I just can't wean myself off because if I wean myself off, I end up not weaning myself off, you know. So um, I have to quit cold turkey. And it hit me, you know, um, motivation. What is my motivation for trying to change my diet? And don't laugh, but here it goes. My motivation for trying to change my diet and becoming more healthy is so I can live another 50 years so I can tell my kids I told you so or so I can tell my kids see what you did to me you know so well it's payback (laughs) I mean you know I want to I want to live to see to see my grandkids and when my grandkids come around and say um granddad you know um, mama just don't understand I'll be like yeah she understand because mama did the same thing to me when she was your age you know or or you know something something to that effect you know what I'm saying so I can be there so I can say gotcha to my kids you know <laughs> that's a crazy motivation but that is, there it is in a, in a nutshell that's what I want that's what I want to do. that's my motivation you know um also i want to you know pretty soon we're gonna me and my wife are gonna be empty nesters so yeah i want to travel man i want to travel i look at it like this man god made this big old beautiful world for us to enjoy why not enjoy it you know um there parts of the world that i want to go see i want I want to go to Egypt so I can see the pyramids. I want to go to Japan. I want to go to um, Saudi Arabia. I want to go to Australia. I want to see the Aurora Bora Alice. The Northern Lights. I want to see them so badly. I also want to be able to go to the very tip end of Alaska wait till the Bering Sea freezes over well the Bering Strait freezes over and walk across into Russia that would be so cool man I don't care if it's 
freezing. I just want to do that joint. I want to do it. <laughs> but yeah, man, I want, I want to, I want to experience different foods. I want to experience um, life in other countries. I want to experience, you know, it's too much, too much stuff on this planet to be stuck in one spot for all your life and to not experience anything you know what kind of life is that man that is boring oh my goodness it's like this man my mom my mom my mom wanted to travel she used to tell me that all the time when she was when i was younger that she wanted to travel well my mom got married and all this stuff and my mom traveled um let's see my mom has been to South Carolina, North Carolina, Tennessee, Alabama, and Florida. And that's it. And her goal was to travel. See, each generation does something a little bit more than the last generation. Her goal was to travel. My goal is to travel. And I've been all over... um, like the eastern seaboard i've been to new jersey been to atlantic atlantic city i've been to virginia um all the way down i've been to philly i've been all the way down to uh, florida um haven't gone to miami but i've also um the farthest west i've been was alabama and tennessee um i've gone to the bahamas you know so I want to I want to travel more and if I don't make it my youngest son loves to travel also so if I don't make it to all those exotic places or all those different places I want to travel I know my son will you know so he, like I said each generation travels a little you know does a little bit more than the last generation but I'm I'm I want to do a lot more um yeah, man. So I, I guess, you know, that's my motivation for for eating healthy, changing my diet, trying to, you know, I'm trying to gain more life, you know, so I can enjoy it. But, um, yeah, man, it's, it's good talking to you guys. It's good seeing you guys uh, again, and, and, and it's good to be seen, you know what I mean? So, um, yeah, thanks for stopping by. If it's uh, a little, little, little. <laughs> if this is your first time to my channel, hit that subscribe button. Come on back, where I will have another talk Wednesday next week. Yo, until next week, folks. Love, peace, and chicken grease. Holla at ya. Peace. <laughs>